Hey guys, and in this video we will be taking a look at Star Wars The Black Series 6 inch Hera Syndulla. Now starting off with this review, we'll be taking a look at the packaging. Same stuff that we have been seeing since uh, the Force Awakens line. Uh, got some artwork of her right here. And she is number 42 in the first wave for uh, The Last Jedi. I picked her up during uh, Force Friday. You could pause that if you wish. And on the back we have a bigger image of her. So you not much to tell with the packaging. Same stuff. Now uh, let's get her out. Now I was hoping that she would have came with a uh, chopper, but nope. Now if I remember correctly, she was due out a long time ago. I think with the Rogue One wave that hit last year during uh, Rogue Friday, but she was delayed. A lot of people thought that. It was because they were including Chopper, but they were just giving her a better updated look. And there she is. I know with the prototype, the goggles did move, but these do not, unfortunately. Now the accessories that she comes with is this blaster, which fits right here in her boot articulation let's get take a look at her head is on a ball joint which moves up and down as well but it is restricted due to these in the back um, shoulders move up but is restricted a little due to her uh, shoulder pads then she does have uh, elbow elbow uh, joints some nice articulation as you can tell right there and then her hands move as well. Got some tight joints. I'll have to get that in some hot water. I don't want to break that off. Alright now. Her waist right here moves. But of course it's restricted. We got a uh, movement right here in the upper legs. Her thighs are on a swivel. And she has double knee joints. And then, of course, the boot or the feet. All right, let's see how good she stands, which her feet are kind of small there if you pose it right she will stand but I have a feeling this one would be the one that would fall down first on the shelf all right uh, let's compare her with uh, the rest of the ghost crew that is out here she is next to well, laying down all right I'm already having issues with her standing. And All right. There she is standing next to Kanan. You can see the height difference right there. Alright now, let's bring in Sabine. They are pretty much the same height, I believe. Now, Hera looks to be a little taller, but with the helmet on, they look about the same. Let's take this off.
Yeah, hair is uh, a little taller than Sabine is. I'm gonna have to work on trying to get hair at the stand right. It's driving me nuts. Alright, well here is the Black Series Ghost Crew that we have for now. Uh, comment below um, which uh, Black Series figure you would like to see done next for uh, Star Wars Rebels. Uh, thanks for watching this short little review video. Please subscribe to our channel for more content. Thanks for watching. Thank you.